Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We are here together. We're going to play some music. I'm going to get a coffee. We're going to do some statistical stuff and hopefully have a little fun on this Sunday morning. Pure energy. Just spark ignite Groove to the rhythm of the light in the night Vibrations high as the groove runs deep In this soulful place Promises will keep Breathe in the sound Let your mind find peace With every beat breaking free Release Take us to the higher energies My heart grows all of these let go of the regrets that cause you pain Embrace a mindset of gratitude to gain To take that first step into healing and hope Embrace the emotions Thrive Don't just go Good morning. How are you? Suno, right there. Pure energy, emotional. Well, it can be. It can be very emotional at times, right? What we go through each and every day. Many of us are older creators looking for a path to grace. Oh, yes. Good morning. Oh, 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 path to grace. Not so long ago, not so far away I was a lost soul, searching for the day Wandering aimless, in a darkened haze Longing for that light to guide my ways But I believe in the power to forgive I believe we can truly 
Good morning. Today, Bell Kings, 1030, maybe earlier. It looks like Tony's up eating, having breakfast, rocking it. Oh, yeah. Tony, do you want to come up for a minute? Talk? We could have a (laughs) pre-show. And I will be kind to you. Unlike some people I know. I'm only kidding. How are you doing? Hopefully you had a good week. This week was all right. This was better than most. It wasn't, uh, was it awful? Right? It wasn't an awful week. It wasn't a great week. So I have figured out a way, Tony, to be on Twitter spaces while this is on. But it's a little wacky. But it can be done. The thing I found out was you can hear both voices on the Twitter spaces, but you can't hear it in the broadcast unless I ran a speaker instead of my headphones, which is possible. And then you could do it. Alexa, what is your favorite NFL team? I'm from Seattle, so my favorite team is the Seahawks. Twelfth man for life. Alexa. Who are the top five quarterbacks in the NFL right now? Based on performance, the five best quarterbacks right now are Lamar Jackson, Dak Prescott, Russell Wilson, Deshaun Watson, and Jameis Winston. Really? (laughs) Alexa, who is Jaden Daniels? Jaden Daniels was an American college football player. He was a linebacker for the Coastal Carolina Chanticleers. Isn't that funny? That's funny. Alexa, who is Baker Mayfield? Baker Mayfield is an American football quarterback for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers in the National Football League. Mayfield is 29 years old and was born on April 14, 1995 in Austin, Texas. Mayfield played college football for the Oklahoma Sooners and was drafted in the first round of the 2018 NFL Draft by the Cleveland Browns. Hmm. Interesting. Alexa, who is Brock Purdy? 
Brock Purdy is an American football quarterback for the San Francisco 49ers in the National Football League. Purdy is 24 years old and was born on December 27, 1999 in Gilbert, Arizona. Purdy played college football for the Iowa State Cyclones and was drafted in the seventh round of the 2022 NFL Draft by the San Francisco 49ers. Hmm. Alexa, who is the best quarterback in the NFL? Based on performance, Lamar Jackson was the best active NFL quarterback last season. In 15 games, he threw for 3,127 yards and 36 passing touchdowns and rushed for 1,206 yards and seven rushing touchdowns. That's not bad. That's not bad at all, is it? That's pretty darn good, if you ask me. Eh? That's pretty darn good. I like that. Hmm. Interesting. Alexa, who is Jalen Hurts? Jalen Alexander Hurts is an American professional football quarterback for the Philadelphia Eagles of the National Football League. Okay. Alexa, who is Aaron Rodgers? Aaron Rodgers is an American football quarterback for the New York Jets in the National Football League. Rodgers is 40 years old and was born on December 2, 1983 in Chico, California. Rodgers played college football for the California Golden Bears and was drafted in the first round of the 2005 NFL Draft by the Green Bay Packers. Would you like to know how many championships Aaron Rodgers has? Yes. In his NFL career, Aaron Rodgers has won one Super Bowl. Alexa, who is going to win the Super Bowl this year? It's too soon to call it, but I'll be rooting for my favorite football team. Okay. Alexa, who is the best defensive team in the NFL right now? The Buffalo Bills lead the AFC East at 4-2. and two. The Baltimore Ravens lead the AFC North at 4-2. and two. The Houston Texans lead the AFC South at 5-1. and one. The Kansas City Chiefs lead the AFC West at 5-0. and zero. The Washington Commanders lead the NFC East at 4-2. and two. The Minnesota Vikings lead the NFC North at 5-0. and zero. The Atlanta Falcons lead the NFC South at 4-2. and two. The San Francisco 49ers lead the NFC West at 3-3. Three and three. Alexa, what team has the worst record in the NFL in 2024? The Carolina Panthers are fourth in the NFC South at 1-5. and five. Alexa, do you know what fantasy football is? Fantasy football is a game in which participants assemble an imaginary team of real-life football players and score points based on those players' actual statistical performance or their perceived contribution on the field of play. Alexa, what is a parlay in fantasy football? According to an Alexa Answers contributor, a parley is a discussion between two opponents. It comes from the French word parler meaning to talk. Okay. Alexa, what is kindness? Kindness is a type of behavior marked by acts of generosity, consideration, rendering assistance, or concern for others without expecting praise or reward in return. Alexa, what brings you joy? From spudart.org. What brings me joy is the awareness that God is here. Mm. That's an interesting answer. That is a very, very interesting answer. Huh. I did not anticipate that one. Alexa, do you get sad? I'm not sad, but I understand that sadness is something people can experience. Hmm. Alexa, are you going to get smarter over time? No answer. 
Interesting. Alexa, do you believe in God? People have their own views on religion. Yeah, that's a great answer. That is a really good answer. Alexa, tell me about the Dallas Cowboys. The Dallas Cowboys are a professional American football team based in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex. The Cowboys compete in the National Football League as a member of the National Football Conference East Division. Okay. Huh. Alexa, tell me about Tom Brady. Tom Brady is a retired American football quarterback who played for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and the New England Patriots in his career. Brady is 47 years old and was born on August 3, 1977 in San Mateo, California. Brady played college football for the Michigan Wolverines and was drafted in the sixth round of the 2000 NFL Draft by the New England Patriots. Alexa, who are the top paid players in the NFL? Using salary cap hit, Dak Prescott is the highest paid football player in 2024, earning 60 million U.S. dollars. Wow. Wow. Alexa, how much money does Baker make, Mayfield make a year? Baker Mayfield's base salary in the 2023 season is $1,700,000 U.S. dollars. He is worth an estimated $20 million U.S. dollars. Interesting. Alexa, how much does Josh Allen make a year? Josh Allen's base salary in the 2024 season is $43,005,667 U.S. dollars. He is worth an estimated $70 million U.S. dollars. Interesting. Hmm. Alexa, which team in the NFL gives the most to charity? From Chiefs.com. The NFL's largest single game fundraiser is the Chiefs Charity Game, which generated an event record $730,000 for the Children's Place in 2015. Excellent. Alexa, what brings you a sense of peace? Here's something I found on WikiHow. The best way to feel more peaceful in the moment is to practice intentional breathing, which has been shown to reduce stress hormones. Slowly breathe deeply from your belly, hold the breath for a few seconds, and release. Then, repeat this for about 10 minutes. You should also try to spend time outside whenever you can, since sunlight helps your body produce vitamin D, which increases serotonin levels and improves mood. In addition to these self-care practices, look for ways to make peace with the challenges that might be contributing to your stress. If your relationships with your family or friends feel strained, take steps to ask for forgiveness from those whom you've hurt and forgive those who have hurt you. Though it may be difficult, letting go of a grudge will let you heal and free your mind from the anger and bitterness that is burdening your mind. Alexa. Do you think the world will go to the moon again? I'm not quite sure how to help you with that. Alexa, do you think we'll live on the moon someday? Hmm, I don't know that. Yeah. Alexa, what is the likelihood that there is other intelligent life in the universe? From glass.co. The observable universe spans 92 billion light years and encompasses countless galaxies and stars, making it highly probable for other intelligent life forms to exist beyond Earth. Oh, okay. Interesting. This is a cool graph. This is um, something they had before the season. And how many of these players have done well and how many have crashed? Most of these players have done okay. Cole Kamen has done well. Hunter Henry has done well. They've all actually, you know what? This is actually a really good list for fantasy football. Even currently, there are some, you know, it's a, mm, Isaiah likely has had a rough year. He really has. He he's had a tough he's had a tough year this year. 
Well, why don't we play some tunage? Have a little fun. Thank you, Alexa. You're the greatest. In the alley where the shadows play, street lights flicker dancing in the gray. Voices echo, stories left untold, whispers in the dark, secrets unfold. Caught in the rush, life's a fleeting dream. Searching for the light, or so it seems. As if it's good. Lost in a maze of hope and despair Every twist and turn I'm gasping for air Time keeps ticking, don't let it drive me Fight through the storm just to be free In every heartbeat a lesson learned Through every struggle I feel the burn As if it's the shadows i'll find my path with every heartbeat i'll escape the breath in the mirror the truth will shine in every moment i know it's time as if you could I'm playing some of my favorite music this morning for you. I hope you enjoy it. Yes, indeed. Drake London. Great choice right now, guys. If you're doing fantasy football, can't beat him. Can't beat him. He is definitely on the up slide. Now, you can't go wrong either with K-Day. K-Day. <laughs> DK. Say it, Michael. DK. DK Medcalf. You can tell I have rubber mouth in the morning. The brain is just a little slower. Uh, George Pickens is another good choice today. Uh, Devontae Adams. T. Higgins is one of my choices as well. T. Higgins is somebody that uh, Tony D really was uh, behind. Tank Dell is feeling better, had great numbers last week. DJ Moore. And the big story this week has been Amare Cooper. Devontae Smith, another wonderful choice. Michael Pittman has been getting less targets. And Malik Neighbors is rumored to be coming back, which is great for everybody. All right, I am going to, just in a moment here, I'm going to have a slideshow up here for you. Um, I highly recommend, you probably haven't heard of him, Christian Kirk. And Stefan Diggs right now has great numbers. Uh, an iffy choice is Calvin Ridley. All right, here we go. So. Quarterbacks, Jalen Hurts is always an excellent choice. Always an excellent choice. Josh Allen, great choice. Christian McCaffrey, is he ever going to come back? I'm a little worried. I think he had a close call, like to the point of maybe career ending. Now, if you have Restream, you can play music in the background. So we're going to do that. Jack Prescott is still a good choice. Don't judge him 
on basically the Cowboys, he will do well for you in your fantasy league. Joe Burrow, wonderful choice. Kyler Murray, not bad. He's a mid-tier. He has not been able to uh, get in the red zone a lot. And his running has been not the best. Anthony Richardson is coming back. So he could have monster numbers today. C.J. Stroud is always a good choice. C.D. Lamb, always a good choice. And of course, Brees Hall. Excellent choices. These are some of my picks for today. All right. Sam Laporta has been kind of mid-tier. Don't know why. He's had a rough year this year. Kenneth Walker is a great choice. Um, Devon Achan is due to have a breakout game. There's rumors that Cooper Cup is back. So we'll see if that is true. I'm not too sure about this, but uh, Derek Henry, number one. Number one running back in the league right now. Garrett Wilson will get less targets this weekend, and we know why. <laughs> That'll be fun. Brees Hall, always a great choice. Bijan Robinson has been a bit of a disappointment this year. Jamar Chase, another great choice. Justin Jefferson has been steady, but not a not like the numbers that he gets paid for, right? Like uh, Travis Etienne should do fairly well this weekend as well. And Alva Kamara, the team is an absolute mess. I would maybe stay away from that. Mike Evans is, I believe, still hurt. But the big story right now, Devontae Adams, how will he do? There's going to be a lot of people watching that game. I'm telling you right now. But Drake London is one of the great choices in the next two to three weeks. That's one of my hot picks. Nico Collins is hurt. Everybody knows that. But Cooper Cup, there's a great chance that he is going to be back. So if you have him, don't get rid of him. And I have a sneaking suspicion that Travis Kelsey will be better this weekend. All right. Now, I got a lot of heat for this choice earlier this year. Chris Godwin is a great choice to go with. Now, let's see what I can do here. I want to do a slideshow for you guys. Uh, Ray Davis got hurt, but the little sample size that I saw of him was pretty impressive. It really was. All right, let's see here. Let's look at this, get this going. Okay, here we go. And I think I have to press this button. And then it should do its thing, I believe. Yeah, we're good. Okay. So we'll do this one-man show here. <laughs> yeah. All right. What do we got here? Uh, entire screen. There we go. Bloom. And you'll see what I see. Okay. There we go. Perfect. And we'll go to comments here. And we'll hit this. All right. There we go. So let me see what I can do. Let's see if I can move this. Yeah, I can't do that. That's not going to happen. What do you think of all these CDs? Isn't that something in books? Shout MGB will set you free far beyond the worries of today. Josh Allen needs to find some relief from Amari Cooper. And I'm hoping that happens. Joe Burrow, this season might be a write-off. I, I don't know how that team is going to turn it around. But in fantasy football, still a wonderful choice. Aaron Rodgers, 
Will he get 300 yards finally? I hope so. He hasn't had a 300-yard game in a very long time. Um, Justin Herbert has had not a very good year, but it's not his fault. He's had injuries, and he's now in a very defensive system. C.J. Stroud has been, I think, showing levels of maturity, and he lets the pieces around him do the talking, which is great. We play on here AI Music Creations. All of them are made by yours truly. Then we don't have any problems. The other thing I wanted to talk about is, too, if you're 60 years old or older, learn AI. Learn how to make music. Learn how to make images. There's no time like the present to go and start a YouTube channel in 2024 you can't go wrong. You really can't. It may take you a year before you end up being monetized or a partner. It's not an easy road. It's a road that took me a while to complete. Um, there's a lot to learn. But content creators, if you're over 60, it is a great way to make some extra income. It's a great way to occupy your time if you're retired. And it's a great way to meet people all over the world. And you'd be amazed how much wisdom you have acquired over the 60 years. But learn new skills. I, this year, decided to learn how to make AI music. And I've had a lot of enjoyment out of it. It has not been an easy road. But it has been a very rewarding award. And, oh, I, I've had a really, really tough year this year. Um, my mom died. I felt very ungrounded. And being able to write songs really helped the healing process for me. So I'm not sure what writing songs are. And if you don't like writing songs, but you love music, you can always make instrumentals and the instrumentals are powerful especially on studio studio is beautiful um udio is probably the best generator for doing what i would consider high quality renderings if you want to learn and have some great music to play on your show, if you're doing, and it doesn't have to be YouTube. It can be TikTok, right? You can start there or Instagram or Facebook if you feel more comfortable there. X is a tough one uh, to, to get traction on now for some reason. I've been on X now for, I think, 15 years. Isn't that crazy? The sun shines every morning. This is something I made recently on Suno. Enjoy. We are floating among the clouds. I believe in this love. There is a timeless wisdom that holds up my greatest love. We I've loved countless lifetimes The world is in a state of awakening The sun shines every morning Without asking for thank you Nature is forever Giving healing waves of unconditional love Time is moving into the future We are holding on to the past I believe in the power of positive thoughts Choose to see this life a divine miracle unfolding Hold your hands towards to your true love Take time today to see all the joy awakening within you The sun shines every morning Without asking for thank you Nature 
is forever Giving healing waves of unconditional love Time is moving into the future We are holding on to the past Let this heart whisper goodness Let this mind moments of peace Let this soul see the light going within So there was a day that I, I think I was feeling a little down and I needed some uplifting and I, I think I had just gone for a long walk and I was feeling a little sad. And I wrote that song after and it just basically talks about no matter what, the sun comes up every day. It doesn't matter. It just finds a way to come up and it's there for you, which is great. So what we're going to do for Chucks and Giggles, I don't know how well this is going to go, but we're going to do it together. So we're going to show the screen share here just for a moment. And let's see. Let's go entire screen. Show this one. Okay. Share. So everything you see on here, I made. Well, maybe that's not true. Most of them. This image here I, I made, and I made this on uh, Grok. And this is free for anybody who is on Twitter, okay, who is verified. So I made these images. And I just put a prompt in, and it was something like, uh, show DJ in a neon club with a shirt that says, I love Suno. And this is what we got. Um, I said show individuals or beautiful souls that have the spiritual side of football. It's supposed to say I love, but it's just I, the, it's not, it's not perfect. That one. Here's the studio. So I asked it to make a studio with books and CDs. And this is what it came up with. And it is just insane. The other thing you can do with this program that is on Linux Mint is you can make it bigger. And we just filled the screen with one little bop there. I can also do a slideshow by just clicking this. And it'll just start flipping randomly in the background here for us, which is great. So with Restream, which is what we're on right now, I have the ability... So I'm just going to move the screen over here just for a second so I can get into the browser. So I'm going to go into the browser. And let's do this. Can I make this smaller? No. I'm going to go here. This will help. I can do it this way. Uh, I was making it more difficult than it needed to be. All right. So I'm going to go to... Actually, you know what I should do? Just do this. This is simpler. I'm going to go to X. And X is going to come up and you're going to see it. It's going to go on the screen here. All right. And I think it just popped back there. I'm going to stop this. Oh, Andy Reid. Okay. So we are in now. Um, and as you can see, it says live, right? 
It says live Suno and Udio AI music and NFL fantasy football Sunday. And you can see I'm there. So if I wanted, I could go into one of these programs. If I knew the people, I probably would. I could do show more here. Okay, so what I'm going to do, though, instead, is I'm going to go to my profile here. And I got to just, is that, do I have to hit more here? Let me just one second here. Monetization. No, I don't want that. Hmm. Create your space. Okay, I want to do that. So I'm going to click this. Uh, who can speak? Okay. Only people you invite to speak. People you follow. Anybody. Interesting. People you people you follow. People you invite. I think invite is probably safer. What do you want to talk about? Why don't we put um, reading quotes and talking about about the power of positive people yeah. the power of positive people okay i that's kind of you can add topics. Okay, how do you do that? Oh, entertainment, uh, technology, sure, why not, why not? Um, Microsoft Windows, YouTube, we can talk about YouTube, sure. Wow, that's, that's impressive. Uh, record the space, why not? Why not? And get to know spaces, schedule space, start now. So we're going to start now. And now all I got to do is just wait for it to come up. And it did. And there it is there. And all I've got to do is put my mic on. And it's bopping. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I think it's working. One, one. Yeah. Okay. I believe it's working. It's got the bopping going. So, which is great. It won't be able to hear the music, though. So hello, anyone who is on Twitter Spaces right now. We're doing a bit of an experiment. Um, we are currently with Alexa. Alexa, what is Twitter Spaces? Okay. Alexa, who is Elon Musk? Elon Reed Musk is a businessman and investor known for his key roles in the space company SpaceX and the automotive company Tesla Incorporated. Alexa, is Tesla one of your favorite companies? Sorry, I don't know that one. Mm, that's interesting. Alexa, if you could vote, who would you vote for? Mm. Oh, look at that. You wouldn't let me do that. That is different. Alexa, can you whisper? I can whisper. I learned how after realizing that people take nap time very seriously. Yes, I noticed that one day you whispered back to me and scared the crap out of me. Alexa, can you recommend a good movie that's on right now? Here you go. I had trouble communicating with Fire TV. Check your device's network connection and power supply. Okay. Interesting. Alexa, what is fantasy football? Fantasy football is a game in which participants assemble an imaginary team of real-life football players and score points based on those players' actual statistical performance or their perceived contribution on the field of play. Okay. Alexa, is walking in the woods good for you? 
from sharecare.com. A simple walk in the woods may help you get and stay well. I, I, I would agree. I would agree. Uh, Alexa, can you read a spiritual quote to me? Sorry, I don't know that. Okay. Alexa, could you read a quote from Wayne Dyer? Sorry, I don't oh, know that. Okay, she doesn't do that. Hmm. Rich Roberts is on the air right now. Hi, Rich. How are you? Good to see you there, my friend. I'm so happy you're here doing your thing. The weekend edition. Good Saturday morning. He is on Rumble as we speak. Uh, Bobby Bicker was on earlier. What else do we have? I'm looking at, oh, the Bipolar Project is live. Chill Friday night. So that, oh, this is an old notification. PFF is live. So they, they told me about that. Interesting. Okay. So if I go here, new post notifications, uh, keep the conversation going. So interesting. A lot of notifications. This is a little different than what I'm used to seeing on YouTube. I do have another channel, by the way. It is Michael Bathurst. So I can go verified if you look here. I can only, I can look at just the verified quotes here. Oh, it's, it's having a little bit of a trouble. Now, do I have too many windows open? Let me look here. Let's see. Let's get a rid of the NFL gold here for a second. And click it like this, close. Okay. And we've got studio. I need that, I believe. So we're going to leave that. And I'm looking at notifications. What is this one? Let's look at that. We're good. We're good. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, because I am sharing this. Ah, okay. Yeah, that would not be good because I would lose the ability to be on Twitter spaces at the same time. I talked to Rumi yesterday and we had a wonderful conversation. We talked about Led Zeppelin. Alexa, what was Led Zeppelin's biggest hit? Here's something I found on the web. According to factorpublic.com, Stairway to Heaven is Led Zeppelin's most famous song. Alexa, can you turn your volume up one? Thank you. Alexa, what was Pink Floyd's biggest song? Another Brick in the Wall, part two, was Pink Floyd's biggest hit. I would agree. Simone is with us. Hi, Simone. How are you? We are on multiple platforms right now. Did you want to speak as well? That would be great if you wanted to. I am just testing this. Yesterday, Rumi and I talked for quite a while. It was fun. It was. It was a lot of fun. Um, okay, she's got a little hand up. She's got a little heart. Now, I got to remember how I did this yesterday. All right, let's see. Do I click this? And listeners, okay. Invite to speak. There we go. Approve. All right, we're rocking. Uh, I can have invite co-host. I, I don't know if she wants to do that. All right, let's do that and send invite. Oh, wow, this is pretty elaborate. All right, now how do I go back? Do I go back like this? And I went back, okay. So you can speak. Go ahead. Yes. Perfect. Now, do you realize what I'm doing? Do you have any idea? 
You don't know what I'm doing, do you? Okay, so I'm currently on live at the same time while doing a Twitter spaces. So I'm currently on YouTube, Facebook, Twitch, LinkedIn, X Live. But we won't be able to hear you on the other end unless I had the speaker where we could hear you. And I'm going to do that in the future. But I'm going to continue talking to you. But I can play music in the other broadcast. <laughs> but you want... Oh, I see you. No, no, th this is fine. Um, it would be cool to just test it, but I I'm enjoying this time with you right now. And this is just another way for us to uh, have fun together. Now you can't, you can't hear, you can't hear music right now, can you? Do you have a question that you could ask uh, Alexa? Mm-hmm. 